Well, good evening, everyone. We usually have rehearsals in the evening. So I'm really, really grateful that you're here. And I want to thank Yvonne, who helped me put this together months ago. She hears here with her husband and son, Will and Will. And I want to thank Joe DeFilippo, our person who's doing the video. Joe runs all of our computers here uh, at St. John's. And uh, we just baptized his second boy a week ago today here at St. John's. So thank you, Joe. So we're going to start from scratch for this wedding rehearsal. So um, don't worry about things as we're doing the rehearsal. I'm going to be telling you to do this and do that. And the rehearsal never runs that smoothly. And that's OK, because we want the wedding mass to run smoothly. So that's why there'll be some bumps and warts and all that, OK? So the first thing I'm going to ask to do is the groom and his best man to go over into that far room over there, OK? All right. Then we're going to ask um, the grandparents and parents to go to the vestibule now, please. And the ring bearer as well. And anyone who is part of the bridal party coming down the aisle, we want you all to go up there too. So the only people who are going to be over there, best man, what's your first name? Christopher. Chris, Chris, okay, Christopher. And the groom is Kevin, right? Okay, we got that straight. You're going to be staying right over there. So, yeah, everybody, everybody who's part of the, coming down the aisle, we want you to go up there. Yeah, that's actually all of you, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think all of you are involved, correct? Your bridesmaids and stuff? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You say you can stay right there, because I'm going to be with you. You're going up there, okay. Now, here's the suggestion. When you come for your wedding rehearsal, you have everyone lined up the way you're supposed to be, and you write it down. You don't have to send it to me, all right? But you want everybody lined up so when you get to church for the rehearsal, the rehearsal goes quickly. We didn't have the chance to do that, OK? So here's what I'm going to do. I want the, uh, the grandparents to come forward, please, and just stand right here. One behind the other, OK? Right in, the, right in the center? No, no, no. The, we have two sets of grandparents. OK, the other, the other grandparents going to be here? OK? Do we have another grandfather? OK, he's on his way? OK, OK, hi. How are you? You're going to stay right there, dear. OK, now we want the parents of the groom in line, please. Um, we want the mom of the bride in line. Well, we, we got to work that out. We're going to see how this is going to line up. Uh, we want to the back of the line, the bride and dad is going to be giving her away. Okay, and we, we have another two, so the two ring bearers together. His name is? This is Wolf. Wolf and Will, where's Will? We're gonna have two, come on over, Will. Okay, we're gonna have two ring bearers, one next to the other, okay? All right, now here's what we have to work out. We're going to be having the lighting of, a Christ, of the Christ candle. So, um, what we're gonna do is when the moms are seated. Okay, who's going to escort mom? Michael. Come on over, Michael. You're nice and tall. Come over. All right. <laughs> now, mom of the of the bride, right? Yes. And mom, mom of the groom is here. Okay. So what we're going to do is. Uh, I don't have to, mom. Yeah. You don't have to be no, in no, 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 we here. do. No, no, we we can. We need one of each. But are they really here? I, I, no, they no are. they're not. No, no, they're not no. We're, we're okay. Okay. We're okay. All right. So, all right. So, what we're going to do is we need um, 
Who's going to be escorting the, the two sets of grandparents, please? We need someone over here. Okay, you're going to walk in front, Justin, okay? And who's going to escort uh, Grandma? Your first name again is? Antoinette. Antoinette, right. Who's going to escort? We need someone to escort Antoinette, okay? Okay. All right, now the, the other thing we need to line up is how you're coming down the aisle. So I think Valerie and Dad, you need to go out in the next room over there, okay? And we need uh, the uh, ring bearers probably, they're going to come right in front of you. Yeah. All right, so they're out there with you too. All right, now we need behind, now we need the rest coming down the aisle lined up with each other, okay? Generally speaking, man, woman, man, woman, man, woman. If we don't have enough men, we'll, we'll figure that out. Okay, you're going to have, okay. Well, you're, you're going to be escorting now, right? First, you, you yeah, can come back up. Yeah. You, can, you can come back up, all right? You're going to come back up, all right? And uh, let's see here. So we have, uh, why don't you, the two of you walk together, okay? All right, and then we, then we uh, so we have how many bridesmaids left? We have two. Two, right here, please. And you're going to be... Uh, no, one behind the other, okay? And um, we're going to be having the men coming down from the other side anyway. So, um, Tim, you can go over there, okay? And tell me your first name. Mike. Mike, Mike. and when you're done escorting, you can go back over with Tim. Okay. All right? Okay, so we're going to have to, we're going to need... Justin's up in the front. He's, but what's... Yeah. No, and Justin's going to be coming back too, yeah. right? So you're going to be going over there after you escort. Just end up right back there, okay? So we're going to have one, two, three men back there, and one, two, three, right? Uh, maid of honor? No. Who, where's maid of honor? She can be maid of honor. You can be maid of honor. So you stay back here by yourself, all right? All right, so now we're going to be set. We have one, two, three, and one, two, three. All right? So, okay, here, let's, let's get back into sound again. So what's going to happen... All right, Chris and uh, Kevin, you hide back there, please. Okay. Now, here's what's going to happen, folks. So you're going to arrive to church one half hour before the wedding tomorrow. Okay, one half hour before. And um, we're going to have the best man and the groom stay back there. Should not be out in the crowd. And we're going to need somebody who's a, a point person to set everyone up. Okay, let's see here. Tell me again your first name. Michael, Michael is going to be the point person. Okay? He's going to be the major D. You've got to give him another 50 bucks for doing this, all right? <laughs> At least, okay? <laughs> He's, I think he wants more than 50 bucks. <laughs> all right, so Michael, here's what's going to happen, Michael. Tomorrow when you come to church... You want to introduce yourself to the organist, say, I'm Michael, and I'm going to be getting everybody ready, okay? And then when we're, everybody is ready, you're going to find me behind church, behind, and you're going to say, we're ready to come. You come back, you go up to the organist, you tell her we're ready, and then you get in line, okay? That's all going to be tomorrow, okay? okay? All right. So... Um, when Michael has told me, after he's told the organist we're ready to start, Michael's going to be back here. He's going to come up to Justin. Justin and say, okay, Justin, go. Come on over, please. And you're going to, then you're going to escort just the grandparents and then mom of the groom. Correct? Do I have that right? Your, your, your grandparents. Question. Yes. They're going to escort, they usually take the woman and the man, like the grandfather. Well, the we, we can do that, but I think in this situation, we're just going to have you walk together, all right? Very good. All right? All right, and then I'll let you know where you're going to be seated. All right, so here's what's happened. Michael has told the organist we're ready to start. He's told me we're ready to start. And then uh, I'll be peeking up there, and Michael, after you come back from telling me we're ready to start, and then the organist, you get Justin going. 
Start coming down the aisle. All right, no, no, Michael, you're not there. You're back. Okay, take your time. You're going to bring them to the second pew. All right? And then you just, what you do, Justin, no, 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 no. No, just the one set of grandparents first, please. Go back. Go like this. Turn around. Come here, Mike. You go like this. Point your hand, and that's all you do, okay? Okay, have a seat. All right, so then when one set grandparent, then the other grandparent is escorted down. Yep, you have to wait for them to be seated. Okay. Bring Antoinette right here, okay. And then you should go, go by right back up, okay. Okay, now that we have, this is the groom's mother and father, correct? Yeah. All right, who is it? You guys could just walk down yourself, all right? And you're going to go right the first two, right there. Actually, mom has to sit at the end because you have to light the, the candle. Okay. okay, so dad, over, okay? Okay. Okay, now we're going to have mom of the bride escorted down. Okay, you're going to just bring her to her seat. One in because, her, because dad will be at the end, Michael, okay? Yep. One in, and then, Michael, you go back up over there, okay? Now, here's what happens. When mom, the second mom is seated, the two of you get up. Come this way, please. All right? Come right up together like this. Come over up to the high altar. And you're going to come up here. One here and one here, okay? We will have it for the ceremony, and just remind me, we need to do it. We're gonna have a candle here and a candle here and here. There's gonna be a taper behind. You're gonna get, it's gonna be a little votive light here. You're gonna get the taper, the wooden taper, get a light from there, light this candle, light this candle, okay? And then when you're done, you turn 180 degrees that way, 180 degrees that way, and you blow that taper out, all the way around, all the way around. And then you put the taper back. Okay. All right, just make sure with the mask that I get that out there. Okay, and together like this, not together. You walk like this, and go back to your seats, okay? All right, just make sure, Yvonne, we put that, those candles out. We have a spare copy before the mask starts, all right? All right, when the moms are done lighting the candles, I'm going to come out here, and as I start coming out here, gentlemen start to say, good afternoon, everyone, or good evening, welcome. As soon as I say that, you guys start to walk down the aisle together, the three, come on. And you're going to line up right over here, okay? You're going to line up right here and face that way, like a firing squad, and look that way, okay? So I say good afternoon or good evening, depending on what time the wedding is, and I'll say, uh, we have some announcements before Mass. Goes just like that, perfect, guys. We have some announcements. One is there are three restrooms for your use. <clears throat> One is in the, where I'm pointing to, in the northwest corner of church, north towards Lake George, west towards the Mohawk. And then we have one in the far left sacristy and the far right sacristy. Please lock the door behind you. We all got that? Okay, for obvious reasons. You will not be locked in. Lock the door behind you, all right? Second announcement about your cell phone. Uh, would you raise your hands if you have cell phones? Quite a few people. We're going to collect all the cell phones now. Is that good? <laughs> no, we won't do that. But we want you to silence your cell phone in one of three ways. And I'll be making this announcement right up here, okay? Okay, so please silence your cell phone either by putting it on airplane mode or vibrate. <clears throat> More uh, preferred, 
turn it off completely. Let's take a moment to do that, please. Okay, everybody, silence your cell phone, okay? I'm going to tell you, if it goes off during Mass, I'm going to be mad at you, you're going to be embarrassed, nobody's going to be happy. So make sure these cell phones are silenced, okay? All right, another announcement is that there are two parts of the Mass of great jubilation. One is right after we do the vows and rings, and I present the couple to you. And uh, the other is at the end of Mass. I will make a polite announcement, applause only. This is not a football field or a hockey rink. Okay, this is church. We want reverence. I'm going to ask the wedding party to cooperate, please. If you guys do it, the rest will do it, okay? All right, so then when I'm done with all of that, I'll, these will be the three magic words. I'll say, thank you. Would you now please rise? At that point, Charlie, followed by Kevin, slowly come out. Okay, and you guys slowly come down the aisle. I'll tell you what to do when you get here, okay? Okay, what happened to the best man and the, the groom? You guys in there? Yo! Charlie, isn't it Charlie? Kevin, okay, start walking down. Chris, I'm sorry. Chris, start walking down, followed by Kevin. Get to the back of the line and look out. As they're doing that, you guys come on down the aisle, please. Slowly, you're gonna, you guys are going to pick a girl up as each one comes. Six pews behind, not 60. Six pews behind. Come on. Good. You pick them up, Justin. You pick your girl up, Justin, okay? Wait a minute. Here. Come over here. Uh, Mike. Not Mike. Uh, Tim. Yes. Okay, yeah. All right. Okay, you pick up Lisa. Come on up like this. Well, no, no Tim, just stay on that side. It's more smooth. Okay, come on up. All right, you're going to go to the far chairs and turn around and face out. No, 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 uh, no bowing. Okay, all right. Okay, you guys do all the way to the far chairs and look out as they're doing. Okay, come on up this way. Far chairs and look out. Okay. All right, ring bearers, come on up. You're going to be sitting probably in the front pew over here, guys. Okay. And we'll have to figure out how you're going to get the rings to the best man, to Chris. All right, have a seat right there. Now, at this point, you, you don't have to stand up now, but during the, during the procession, everybody will be standing. You don't have to stand now, all right? So at that point, come on over here, Chris. All right, now, what happened to the maid of honor? What happened to the maid of honor? Okay, you, you, all right, she came down already. That's you. All right, you got to swap. Go up there and swap with her, please. Okay, go ahead. Come on down here, please. You gotta, we got to swap. That's why we have a rehearsal. Okay. We're going to go through this whole thing one more time at the end of the, of the rehearsal. Okay, I'm going to go up there, please turn around. All right, now at this point, guys, there's only three, so you guys come over here, all right? You guys come over here, there's only three, all right? All right, just like that, all right? All right, come on over, Chris, and you are again? Allie. Allie? Yeah. Okay, come on up like this. You're going to go up there to the far right and far left chairs. And you stand here to pick up your groom, uh, your, your bride. All right. Come on down, Daddy. Okay. Got a nice pace, too. Steve, right? Steve. Yes. Yeah. I think I did his marriage years ago. I think I did. Okay. You're going to come here. You're going to kiss your daughter. Okay. All right. You're going to come over. You guys are going to shake hands. Be careful what you say. There's a microphone bugged over here. So. <laughs> I've already said it. <laughs> okay, Steve, going to sit there next to your wife. Okay, arm and arm. Now watch what's going to happen here. As soon as these guys pass, the six of you turn completely the other way. As soon as they pass you, come on up. Everybody together. Together. Horrible. Go back. Go back. Let's try this again. All right? That's why we have a rehearsal. Don't forget, there's videos and cameras taking. We want this nice, all right? So as soon as they pass your bodies, the six of you turn around. Come on. Together, all together, everybody? A little better, but not great. Okay, going, going up there, please. We'll do it. We'll do this one more time, okay? All right, so that's the opening procession down and the procession out is the real guts of, of the whole thing. And we're going to go through the rest of the ceremony now. We'll do it one more time. So it's the procession down. That's... The procession down and out is like the bread of the sandwich and everything else is the meat or the fish in between, okay? 
So when you get here, I'll be at the altar, and I'll uh, uh, make the sign of the cross, okay? And I'll say the opening prayer. At the end of the opening prayer, there's another prayer, and I'll say, please be seated. Every time I say, please be seated, the wedding party does that, okay? Be seated, please. All right, then I will call the first reader. So how about, um, um, how about our lector, Grandpa? We're going to call you up, okay? Our first reading will be read by Bob. You know what to do, Bob? You bow, okay? All right, go over there, Bob. Now, Bob's one of our star lectors, okay? I say that because he's our only lector. No, that's not true. <laughs> and, and Bob is going to, since he does this every week, we don't need him to do it now. He's going to proclaim the first reading. There's a big sign here. Bob, would you read that sign nice and loud? Please do not touch the microphone. What does that mean? Do not touch right. the that microphone. That means you don't do this. It's been done. That's why we have the big sign, okay? You just stand here and project your voice, okay? So Bob will do the first reading. When he's done, he'll say the word of the Lord. Go back and bow, Bob, please, down there. All right? Right there, right? The top, top, the top, right up in the top. Yep. Bow, please. And back to your seat, okay? Then we're going to have the second reading will be read by Yvonne. Come on up, Yvonne, okay? Same thing, you bow here. Okay? Just go up there. And Yvonne's read many, many times before, so we don't need to listen to her. Okay? And when you're done, Yvonne, down there, turn around and bow. Okay? All right? Right there. Good. Perfect. Okay? And then I'll say, please rise. Everybody's up. Okay? Then I come over here, and I read the gospel. And then when I'm done with the gospel, I'll say, please be seated. And then I'll give the homily. It goes about 50 minutes. You believe that? Nobody believes that? <laughs> okay. The whole mass will probably go 40 minutes. All right. And as part of the homily, there will be the wedding reflections I'll be getting from Kevin and Valerie at least a month before the wedding. And that will be the major part of the wedding. So when I'm done with the homily, watch what's going to happen. Okay? Just pay attention to me, please. I'm going to... The book will be over here. Now... I'm going to go like this. Uh, everybody but Allie comes forward. Allie's going to horseshoe this way and meet us over there. Okay? Come right across. Okay? You don't hold hands yet. Okay, perfect. All right? Now, if you're not, that's, that's just perfect. If you're not, like, centered, I'm going to center you, right? Okay. You're going to, but you are. So just sort of like three quarters, turn this way, Kevin. Okay? You don't hold hands yet. So then I go through um, the vows and the rings. Most of the time in recent years, people want me to say, do you take her, boom, 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 and you say, I do. And you say, if you want me to um, recite, do you recite the vows, you let me know that the week or two before the wedding, okay? All right, so then when the vows are done, and then Chris will have the ring or rings, you got to figure out how we're going to get it from the ring bearers uh, sometime before the wedding, okay? And you're going to put your hand out there, Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. So you're going you're gonna to have, and I'm going to bless your, the two rings in your hand, okay? In the wallet, too. The, in the wallet, right, wallet. right. And the, your hand will never be the same after I bless it, okay? All right. So then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you the ring, and you're going to look at, uh, hold this for a second, Chris, please. You're going to look at each other, not me. I'm going to whisper, and you say it nice and loud, okay, to each other, okay? Okay. All right, you already put the ring on her. Don't ask me which finger because I won't know. All right. <laughs> Let's see, we're still hot here? Okay, so you're going to look at her. I'm going to whisper you say it nice and loud. Valerie. Valerie. Receive this ring. Receive this ring. As a sign. As a sign. Of my love and fidelity. Of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. Of the Holy Spirit. You sure you haven't done this before? <laughs> Uh, okay, now I'm gonna I'm gonna hold it. Then you look at each other. Okay. And if you don't, I'll tell you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna whisper you say nice and loud, Valerie. Kevin. Kevin receive this ring. Receive this ring. As a sign. As a sign. Of my love and fidelity. Of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And, the son, and in the Son. And of the Son. And of the Son. <laughs> and of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Okay, good. Now at that point, you hold hands the whole rest of the mess. All right. 
And at that point, I'll make a polite announcement about not you know, doing more and applauding. We'll do that when it comes to the mass. And we now, I now, we now congratulate and welcome Mr. and Mrs. Kevin and Valerie Talbot. Everybody applaud. Come on, listen, okay? Cut, that's enough. Okay. All right, so at that point, I'm going to say, now Kevin and Valerie are going to light the Christ candle, uh, a beautiful part of our ceremony that shows they are no longer two but one. At that point, Allie and Chris step back, please. You guys walk this way, go up to the altar together like your moms did. All right? No, you're going to stand back there, okay? You're going to go right up to the candle. We'll have that candle between. Yvonne's going to remind me. Now, with your right, you're going to go like this. Step back and do this slowly because they're going to want to watch. You're going to take the candle that's there, lit. You pick it up. You take the one that's lit, and you like the center one. And you hold it for, like, look at each other. You hold it for, like, 20 seconds at least because they want to take pictures, right? Then when you're done, you, take, you get that candle in your hand that you, you use the light. You turn 180 degrees this way or around. 100, uh, no, that way. That way. And you blow the candle out. And make sure you turn because otherwise you're going to blow the middle candle out. Put the candle back. Okay. There. In there. In the place. Arm and arm. Walk around. Back to the center of the, of the aisle. Back to the altar. Okay. You stand right here. All right, and just look out, as you, no, right in the center, right in the center. Now, at that point, we will likely have someone read the prayers of the faithful. And when that person, I'll call that person up, we'll have the prayers there. They Let me start the opening prayer. They don't leave until I'm done with the final prayer. Then they go back, okay? And then when that's done, since we don't do the offertory gifts anymore, since the pandemic, I'll say, please be seated. You guys go back. Allie, go back, okay? You wait, and they all sit down together. Okay, good. All right, and have a seat. Okay, good. Then mass goes on as usual. So here's how communion goes. And after the Our Father, there's a special blessing for the bride and groom only, and I'll ask you and only you to be seated. Okay, we'll do that during the mass. And then I will bring communion. Are all the four of you going to communion? You're all going to communion, so I'll bring communion to the four of you. Here's how the wedding party will go. So those of the six of you who are receiving, you're going to come to me, walk up one step, and back to your seat. Okay, Michael? And tell me again. Jennifer. Jennifer, you re receive communion from here? Oh. Here? Yes. Okay, walk up on one step and walk back to your seat. Walk up one step, back to the next, come over. All right, okay. Got like this. Receive, back up. Okay. Okay. Lisa and Tim, okay. One up there. Back to your seat. Okay, you're at the end here. Okay, good. And then I give it to the congregation, okay? So then, when communion is over, there's, there's um, um, a shorter blessing, and then I will come over to congratulate you guys. And uh, when I get out of the way, you're going to kiss. The two of you are going to go down, two of you in the wedding part. So let me congratulate you first. Stand up. Stand up. Okay. All right. Very good, big one. Okay, you get out of the way, you kiss. Okay. Like for real? Like for real. Okay. All right. Start, you guys are all standing now. You're all standing. Everybody's standing at that point. Go. Yep. All right, you're going to walk out the same way we came in. Just the people up in the sanctuary. That's it. Okay, parents and grandparents don't walk out. You can if you want. You can. Parents can. All right, you guys go. Arm in arm. Okay. All right, now then the parents follow. Grandparents don't have to go if they don't want, but the, the parents follow. Okay. All right. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do all that again, but it'll be, it'll be quicker, all right? So we want grandparents back up. Before we go through the thing one more time, much quicker, any questions? All right. Okay, so we want Kevin and Chris back there, please, where you came from, up in the sacristy. All right. So once again, what has happened, I'll just repeat it. Once again, what, it, what has happened.
Of all people who didn't turn his phone off. Okay. <laughs> okay. So once again, you're gonna come half an hour before the ceremony starts. Mike is the Mater D. Mike is gonna introduce himself to the organist. Say, I'm Mike, I'm gonna be the one coming up to tell you when we're starting. When we're ready to start, you have three people you gotta see. You gotta see me first, see Janet second, and uh, well, I'll see you come down. Then you get in line, all right? So when uh, Mike is ready, and I'll be peeping out, just, Mike has Justin, Mike, come on up and tell Justin to come on down to his court. Go ahead, Mike. Mike, you gotta tell Justin to start. He's gonna be waiting for you, okay? As we practiced, that's good, good pace. Which side you over here? You just turn and just point to the seat, Justin, that's it. Just point to the seat, okay? Good. All right, you go back, okay? Bring in Antoinette down, right? Take your time. Okay, right there, good. Wonderful, very good, very smooth. Okay, now we have the next set of parents come down, please. And as it, exactly, just you go one in, Will, so Yvonne's on the end. By the time the wedding comes, Will, you won't have that game. <laughs> That's a few, uh, it's a bit away. Okay, now we have mom escorted down. Okay, very good. And again, you go one in, mom, okay? Because Steve will have the, uh, okay, just go right there. Michael, just go right over, back up, okay? All right, now, so once uh, mom number two is seated, then the two moms get up without any further ado. Go up, make believe the can is there, it will be there for the, for the mass. Kind of together, you, no, no rush, no need to rush. Okay, your right hand, Yvonne, your left hand, mom. Mom, tell me your first name again. Marilyn, your left hand. Yvonne's right hand, your left hand, okay? If you get that taper, the wooden taper, get a light, light the two candles, turn 180 degrees around, all the way over, blow it out, put the taper back, walk together back this way, okay? Together, okay? All right. So uh, as soon as the moms are seated, I'll be watching all this, I'll be peeping. I'm gonna come out here. Welcome everyone, make the announcements about the cell phones in the bathrooms, and my exact words for you to start will be, thank you, would you now please rise? It's always that. Thank you, would you now please rise? The music will begin. Uh oh, what happened to you guys? Okay, so as soon as I come out to make the announcements, you're walking down, okay? Okay, I think Tim, are you first, Tim? Because Lisa, is Lisa the first in line? All right, so Tim, you're, you're first, okay? All right? So just remember, as soon as I make this announcement, say good afternoon, good evening, you guys come out, okay? Over, okay, over there. All right, and then as soon as they're there, okay, Lisa, come on down. We're just gonna do the walking down, uh, the vows and walking out. The rehearsal will be done in about seven or eight minutes. Okay, good. Okay, Tim. Okay, pick her up, Tim. Good. Okay, just three pew, just three chairs this time. Perfect. Okay. Very nice. Good. And turn around. Face that way. No, face that way. Okay. Just three. Okay, you're gonna turn around. Face that way. Okay. What happened to Chris? Hey, you guys. As soon as I'm done with my announcement, you're supposed to be coming out. Thank you, would you now please rise immediately, okay? 
You come out, okay? Okay, you're standing way over here. Soon, Chris, thank you. Would you now please rise? Everybody stands up, the music, you come out, all right? I'll be in there with you, coaching you, okay? Come up here. Okay, good. Ring bears, okay? Okay, that's all right. All right, come on down, Daddy and, and Bride, okay? Okay, very good. All right, congratulations, okay, very good. Come on up, Daddy goes back with Maria, okay. They, don't have, they, do, they do not stop, go back please. They do not stop, they just walk right past you. Okay, so don't wait for them to turn around, just come on right up, okay. Everybody together, that's it, good, perfect. All right, all right. so we, we don't have to go through the rest of the ceremony. You did that fine. We're going to do the procession out, and then we'll, okay? So I'm going to be congratulating you guys, all right? Be stepping out of the way. A kiss. Okay, go. Go. Okay, the rest of the procession, go. All right. Very good. Okay, you can stop right there. Come on up, everybody sit down for a, a minute. Any place, it doesn't matter, yeah. All right, the idea of a rehearsal is not that everything goes perfectly, but it goes smoothly, and it will. At the wedding tomorrow, it will, okay? But do you have any questions? Are there any questions at all? All right, thank you for coming. The rehearsal went about 40 minutes, a little longer than we thought. The wedding will go about the same, but we won't uh, be giving a homily at this, this dress rehearsal, so the wedding will go a little bit short, the wedding mass. We'll see you tomorrow, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Joe, you can cut, okay?